Smile and learn. Today we're going to learn what healthy eating means. What is healthy eating? For humans and other living beings, eating is the process of taking in food. This is how we obtain the necessary nutrients to survive and carry out daily activities. If we want to grow healthy and strong and stay energized throughout the day, we should eat healthy. Healthy eating should be complete, including foods that contain all nutrients and balanced. That is to say, our intake of every nutrient should come in the right proportions. During the digestion process, nutrients in foods are absorbed in the intestines and from there they are distributed all over our body through the circulatory system. Food Nutrients We could group food sources in many different ways. One way of doing that is by looking at the nutrients they provide. These nutrients are Carbohydrates, also called glucides, fats, also called lipids, proteins, water, vitamins and mineral salts. Would you like to learn more about them? Carbohydrates Carbohydrates are nutrients that provide our body with energy so we can exercise or play. But not all carbohydrates are healthy. Bread, rice, or pasta are healthy, high-carb foods. There are high-carb foods, also called foods high in glucides, that are not good for our health. An example would be sweets like pastries or candy. Eating fruit is a healthy way to include glucides or carbohydrates in your diet. Besides, fruits provide us with vitamins, too. Fats Fats are nutrients that provide us with energy and help with vitamin absorption. That's why they are essential for our body. Nuts, avocados, or olive oil are high-fat foods. Other foods like meat or butter are also high in fats. Eating too much of them may be harmful to your health. Eating healthy is not about adding many high-fat foods to your diet. Proteins Proteins are nutrients that make up the tissues of our body, like muscles or bones, for example. Also, proteins transport some vitamins and boost our immune system. Animal proteins are found in food sources like meat, fish, eggs, or dairy products. There are also vegetable proteins, like the ones found in legumes. Remember to combine both for a balanced diet. Vitamins and Mineral Salts Vitamins and mineral salts are nutrients that help us stay healthy so that our body can carry out the vital functions. Fruits like oranges, strawberries or bananas, and leafy greens or vegetables like spinach, broccoli or carrots are packed with vitamins. Minerals are found in the water, in small amounts, and in different types of food, like lentils or meat that contain iron. Did you know that in order for our body to get the vitamins it needs, we should eat at least five portions of fruit and vegetables a day? Water Water is very important in order for us to stay hydrated. It is the most abundant substance in all living beings. Did you know that the majority of your body consists of water? That's why it is vital to drink water throughout the day and drink even more when we do physical exercise or when it's hot outside. Healthy Eating Tips To have a healthy diet, we recommend to follow this advice. Eat different kinds of foods that will provide you with all the nutrients you need. Eat at least four meals a day with the right portion size. Drink water frequently to stay hydrated. Do physical exercise to strengthen your body and use the energy from the nutrients in the food you've eaten. If you follow this advice, you'll be preventing diseases like obesity or diabetes. Watch what you eat to grow healthy and strong. Enjoy your meal. 
Do you know what carbohydrates are? And which foods contain them? Let's find out. What are they? Carbohydrates, also called glucides, are nutrients that are the main source of energy for our body. Foods that contain these nutrients should be part of our everyday diet. Types of Carbohydrates Carbohydrates can be divided into three different groups depending on their chemical structure. Glucose, or fructose, is the simplest form of carbohydrates. Fruits like bananas, apples, or pears contain this type of carbohydrate. Another type of carbohydrate is sucrose, often called table sugar and lactose. Sweets and dairy products are some examples of foods that contain them. The most complex type of carbohydrate is formed by many carbohydrates. One example would be starch, found in potatoes or rice. What do carbohydrates provide us with? Healthier carbohydrates are mainly found in plant-based foods like cereal, leafy greens, vegetables, fruit, and legumes. These foods are also rich in other nutrients. For a more balanced diet, include them in your everyday meals. Carbohydrates provide us with enough energy to carry out tasks like studying, doing sports, or playing. It's very important to include a healthy amount of carbohydrates in our diet to avoid feeling tired or getting sick. Less healthy carbohydrates are those that contain sugar. They are found in foods like pastries or candy. We should avoid them or eat smaller portions as they don't provide us with steady energy. If we reduced consumption, we would prevent diseases like diabetes or obesity. There's a huge variety of foods that contain carbohydrates. If you're intolerant or allergic to any of them, you would always have plenty of other healthy choices. Carbohydrate-rich dishes You can have cereal and fruit or toast for breakfast or a snack. For the rest of your meals, you can combine them to create different dishes like spaghetti, paella, lasagna, or even lentils with rice. Have you ever tried them? It's a dish packed with tons of nutrients. Now you know what carbohydrates are. Ready to include them in your diet? Do you know what proteins do for the body? Which food contains proteins? Let's find out. What are they? Proteins are nutrients that make up the tissues of our body, like muscles or bones, for example. Also, proteins transport some vitamins and boost our immune system. Types of proteins There are animal proteins and vegetable proteins. Animal proteins are found in food sources like meat, fish, eggs, milk or dairy products like yogurt or cheese. Vegetable proteins are found mainly in legumes like chickpeas, lentils or beans among others. Quinoa, seeds and nuts also contain proteins. What do proteins provide us with? Proteins help us grow and stay healthy. Remember that a healthy eating plan should consist of different types of foods. 
That's why our protein intake should come from both vegetable and animal sources. Consuming plant-based foods provides us with other nutrients like vitamins and minerals, while animal-based foods provide us with some of the minerals we need, and also with fats. Let's see which foods you could eat to include protein in your diet. Protein-rich dishes. Legume salads or chickpea hummus are vegetable protein dishes. Roast meat or eggs also contain protein. But remember to include other nutrients like carbohydrates or vegetables as side dishes in your diet. As you have seen, there are many protein-rich foods that can keep us healthy and strong. See you soon! Do you know which foods have vitamins? And do you know what minerals do for our body? Let's find out! What are they? Vitamins and mineral salts are nutrients we need in small amounts. They help us stay healthy and thanks to them, our body can function correctly. Types of vitamins and mineral salts. Vitamins are represented with letters. Did you know that? A, B, C, D, E, and K. There are so many. Fruits and leafy greens are those foods packed with vitamins, but meat and fish contain vitamins too. For example, oranges and strawberries have a lot of vitamin C, while carrots provide vitamin A. Among the minerals found in foods, there is iron, calcium, phosphorus, sodium, or potassium. But there are many more. Did you know that water contains minerals as well? We can find minerals in all types of foods. Lentils and meat, for example, are packed with iron. Foods like yogurt and milk contain calcium, which is very important for our bones and teeth. What do vitamins and minerals provide us with? Vitamins and minerals help our body carry out the vital functions. It's very important to eat fruit and leafy greens at least five times a day to get all these nutrients, and this way, maintain a balanced diet. Vitamin and Mineral Rich Foods For breakfast or snack, you can make a fruit salad mixing different types of fruit like bananas, apples, kiwis, or strawberries. Combine them in any way you like. This way, your salad will be packed with different vitamins and mineral salts. For lunch, you can make salads mixing fruits and vegetables. You can also make vegetable cakes or mix vegetables with other foods like rice to make risottos. Ready to add vitamins and mineral salts to your diet? Do you know what fats are and which foods contain them? Did you know that not all high-fat foods are healthy? We're going to tell you all about them. What are they? Fats, also called lipids, are nutrients that provide us with energy and help with the absorption of vitamins. That's why they are essential for our body. Types of fats Fats are divided into three different groups depending on their chemical structure. Saturated fats are found in animal-based foods like meats, butter, and cold meats. Palm oil, which is an ingredient used in packaged pastries, is also rich in fats. 
Monosaturated fats are found in foods like raw olive oil, nuts, or avocados. And lastly, there are polyunsaturated fats, also called fatty acids, like the omega fats. Fish or walnuts are very high in omega-3 acids. Healthy fats come from plant-based foods like nuts and some vegetable oils. They are also present in fruits like avocados. Fatty acids like omega-3 are also good for our health. Even so, we should control the amount of fatty acids we include in our diet. Less healthy fats that are consumed in large amounts can be harmful to our health. These fats are found in meats, packaged pastries, and some dairy products like butter. What do fats provide us with? Why are they important for a healthy diet? Did you know that the cell membrane and hormones are made of fats? That's why consuming fatty foods in moderate amounts is good for our cells. To stay healthy, choose vegetable fats like raw olive oil and avocados, or fatty acids like ones found in fish. Let's see which dishes you could add to your diet to include healthy fats. Fat-rich dishes you can have avocado toast for breakfast or a snack. Sprinkle some nuts on top too. You should cook foods using olive oil to include fats in your meals. You can also add foods like meat, eggs, or fish that contain healthy fats. Now you know which foods contain fats. Remember that it's good for your health to consume fats in small amounts. We've learned so much in just one video. Did you know there are many more videos? Imagine how much you could learn. Subscribe to the Smile and Learn educational channel to learn and have fun at the same time.